Greetings and salutations to this tech rodot here back with the finale of Sonic Rush Adventure and the cutscene is about to start so we are going to be doing that. Okay, Sonic Tails, Blazing Marine, okay. There they try to think of a way for Sonic Tails to get home. Yada yada yada. Sonic, you mentioned before that the Solar Emerald's power allowed you to come here. Perhaps you'd be able to use the Chaos Emerald's power to get back to your home. Well, I was working on a device that will use the power of the emeralds. It should be able to break the dimension barrier, but it'll take time to calculate. Why did I... Okay, there we go. I know you don't mind it, but... Not at all! Where are the pirates gone? I'm not exactly busy. Well, you're here. Would you like to help me work on my new ship? What, Marine? You're building? Of course. I need a new ship to go on new adventures. The SS Supermarine. Super. Well, you saw how the first one was all crook. So now. <laughs> Slam. Sorry that I can't keep up with the things. They're going too fast. Your Highness, I must speak with you. Haven't I told you not to call me that? My my apologies, Princess Blaze. Go on. What is it then? It, it appears that the Royal Joseptor was stolen last night. What? The Jewel Scepter? Tell me everything. Yes, well, we, we put the scepter back in the treasury where it was safe. But around dawn, it seems that it was stolen. How could you let this happen? I, I know you, Highness. I, oh, hold on. Just as I was getting to the bottom of things, getting to the bottom of what exactly? Well, there is another legend told about the scepter. Another legend? The legend tells that a power of the stars and a key. The tombs come by often. Power of the stars? Key? I'm not exactly sure what the what the power means, but the key is the scepter itself. What if we ah. a terrible secret? So, if the scepter is in is the key. Well, hold on a sec. I don't think that's all bad. I mean, who could have taken it? You defeated the pirates? Hmm. Speaking of which, though, I've been thinking about something. What is it, Tails? Didn't it sound like the pirates were stealing it for someone else? There was something that they said when they were leaving. Right, then ye shall all know his wrath, Savvy. His. That's right. Now that you mention it, it makes sense that they'd be stealing it for someone else. The question is, whose dirty work were they doing? Whoever it is, whoever it was, must have been the one to steal it. Huh? Everyone... But uh, I'm mad it passed me for going through these too fast because I can't read them. I know why passed me did because you, you, there's a lot of cutscene to go through here before we get to the final boss, but it's still annoying, you know? I can't keep up with it. Ah, my dear friend Sonic! Long time no see! Who the heck is this guy? And what were... What was he doing? Dr. Eggman! What are you doing here? Oh, hoo 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 hoo! Wouldn't you like to know? I suppose I'll just tell you. I'm here because of the ultimate power, son. Ultimate power? Indeed. 
A power that's planned Wait. And I'm guessing that's not going to be good for the rest of us. I merely plan to see the power to turn this world into Ragman Land. You still have that plan? Eggman Land, what the? Eggman, so then everything that's happened to us. Woohoo! You're a clever little fox, I knew you'd figure it out. The person who was behind everything. The one who stole the Jewel Scepter. The real criminal mastermind behind the whole thing. This looks like that bloke with the that mustachio pirate bloke. It was you, Eggman! Ho 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 ho! Ah yes! Who else could it have been? And must I s- It must- Just in case you don't believe me! What? What are you going to do with it? What a- What a- What I plan on doing? If the scepter really is the key spoken of in, in the legends, and this power of the stars must be what you're after. Isn't that right, Eggman? Brilliantly worked out, your highness. Brilliant indeed. Eggman Nega! Place. And you, if memory serves me correct, you're Sonic the Hedgehog. So, you're a part of this too! Oh boy! Now I've seen double. Maybe I need to get my head checked. I figured you'd be here, Nega. So then, the power of the stars. According to my research, it should be right below us. The power. <laughs> oh, you poor thing. This world and Dr. Eggman's world exist as separate dimensions. Earth... Each of us can think of what makes this possible is the so-called... When Nega told me about the... that I practically jumped for joy! The only pr problem, though, was finding the key. The true scepter. Yes! And so we get... So that's why those there were pirates everywhere. Once we had the key, we just needed to find out where the... And so, the great deal, right here, underneath this very island. <laughs> of course! We didn't count on you, but the bunch of you showing up. But that's insignificant. Soon, the power of the stars will be ours. You don't honestly think I'm going to let you get away with this? And it's even bigger than before, Doctor Eggman. <laughs> Timing. Now, Sonic! I'm afraid I've got things to do! The Jewel Scepter! Hold it right there! You still haven't told me about Eggman Land! My, my! Now who's this little brat? Please! Please needs that scepter back! And I still... Once we have the power, the stars are returning. How does that sound? Now, we'll see you later. Get back here, Eggman. Wait up! You still haven't told me about Eggman Land! <laughs> Marine's so stuck on Eggman Land, that's funny. What in the world is this? I think it might have something to do with the Eggman and the unleashing of the stars. Then we have to find the same... We have to find a way to stop it. Don't worry. With the magma hurricane that I've been work... That I've built. 
we should be able to break the barrier. Then we can follow after Eggman and Eggman Mega. Nice work, Tails. <laughs> Oi! You hear that? And I'm gonna make you tell me about Eggman Land. <laughs> Ta-da! Here it is! Struth! I'm beginning to think that too. Ah. Enough of that. We need to get started at once. Right! Okay! Oh, this is gonna be... I'm no, having trouble keeping up. We need to catch them before they st get the power of the stars. Ready, set, and launch! It's too powerful! Sonic, I'm falling over! Ah! What, what, what the? Ah. Magnificent! The energy levels on this crap's readouts are through the roof! I never imagined that this sort of power. Even the Chaos Emeralds and the Solar Emeralds can't compare to this! Is that what unleashing the power of the stars can do? Behold, Sonic! With the power, I am at last indestructible! <laughs> at last! What? It was your royal family that kept the scepters nice and safe for all these years. Now that they've served their purpose, though, I have no further use for them. It will take only a fraction of this power to wipe out your entire kingdom. Ugh! Blaze, stay calm. Now, the world shall be my plaything. I shall bring about an era of fear and power. Please, you're supposed to be the princess, remember? You need to keep a level head. Who's going to look out for the peop people in this world if something happened to you? Who else is going to be able to... Uh... Yes. This is my duty as princess. My duty and my power. Or my honor. I will not allow my people... To come to such suffering. Sonic, if we don't stop them, then nothing will. Right. Now's the time. Let's do it. What? You dare? Okay, I'm not gonna read this. I'm not gonna read this text here because this this is just telling you how to do the boss fight, and I already know how to do it, and I don't need to read it for commentary. So yeah, just enjoy looking at this screen for a minute because it takes a second to get through all this. Because past me did have to read it. So just 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 hold on a second. It did take me ten lives to do this, but I only kept the clip in my final try because. I didn't have the patience to edit together, I didn't have the patience to look through all the deaths and edit together the ones I wanted to keep. So, just kept the final try. 
Okay. Let's do this. Let's start the final boss, baby. And the, it's actually my second favorite final boss in the series, next to uh, the final boss of Sonic and the Black Knight. Say what you will about Sonic and the Black Knight, but this final boss is epic as hell, especially the music. Like, that, that's the most epic final boss in the series. Do not at me. Now, the game as a whole is definitely not the best game in the series. I definitely hold... Uh, Sonic Rush Adventures, Sonic Unleashed, Sonic Adventure 2, um, and Sonic, uh, Colors above it, but, and Sonic Mania, but it, it's not bad, it's not a bad game, it's really not. Now, Sonic and the Secret Rings, that's a bad game, because it's a bitch to even play, but Sonic and the Black Knight is heat. It's a great game, fam. People need to stop shitting on it. People need to stop focusing on stopping 06 hate and stop Sonic and the Black Knight hate. Like, I'm for real about that. As you can see, I kind of cheese this boss on my final try. I kept trying to do it the right way where you're supposed to switch between characters. And then this time, I was just like, fuck it. I'm going to brute force this with Blaze. I do not care anymore. I'm just gonna, like, after nine tries... Or, or after 10 deaths, I was just done with this. And luckily, that me being done with this is actually <laughs> what got me to beat it. Which is kind of ironic, because usually when I get done with something, I get so frustrated that I start doing worse. But here, like, I kill it. And I don't even use both characters. Like, I, I am impressed with myself here. Like, I'm happy that I beat this boss this way, because it... Like, bam. Proud of myself. Even if I did basically cheese it. And I'm not talking the snap. Take this. Anyways. I got the Eggman Land theme stuck in my head now after all that Eggman Land talking the cutscene. Do, 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 do. I probably don't sound like it because I'm not really doing it in the right tune. I don't know how to mimic the tune of uh, Eggman Land, unfortunately. And I keep getting notifications. I really hope you don't hear the vibrations uh, in the commentary from that because... I could imagine that being annoying. Yeah, the mess out as well. Yeah, I'm sorry that this video had to be done this way, but like, when I kept, I, I tried the boss a bunch of times in, uh, in landscape mode, and I just couldn't beat it because I couldn't see where the, his attacks were going. So I just changed it to portrait this? mode. And just like decided to make uh, the video smaller than like the landscape mode videos I usually upload. So yeah, that's why it looks this way. Ooh, curse you! <laughs> Time to die, everyone. Nigga, what are you about to do? <laughs> what? No, not that, buddy. Power Buster Laser, Planet Buster Laser, fire! There goes Marine to the rescue. Hey, do you like that power, Eggman? Sonic, please go! Sonic! No, go! And we kick this ass. A bye bye, Egg Wizard. Bye bye. Nice. 
Now the final cutscene. We're here. We're finally here. Sonic. Oh, Blaze. Good morning, Blaze. So, this is the ship you've built, Tails. Yeah, designed to, to tear through uh, dimensions. I got the SS Tornado X. I never thought it'd be... Well, it's all thanks to the power of the Chaos and the Solar Emeralds. So, this craft uses the power of both Emeralds. Yeah, the energy acts to... Blah. Hmm, so then, the Chaos and the Solar Emeralds. Sort of like the North and South Pole of, of a, a magnet. They have the power to repel, then they have the power to attract. And if... Right. That's what the Eggmen were both after. So then, how do you prevent that from happening? Well, I haven't done anything special in particular. Because of that, I was able to put the ship together. What do you mean? I got to thinking. Doesn't it seem like the emeralds are trying to help us? The Chaos Emeralds and the Soul Emeralds? Yeah, if they weren't, I don't think we'd be able to properly put this together. <sighs> trying to help us, huh? Huh. I'm going to get ready to launch soon, Sonic. By the way, Blaze, what happened to whatever? Oh, the scepter. It's been returned to the altar. Under heavier guard. Oh, good. Huh? Do you think maybe you were brought here for a reason? Brought here by who? By the emeralds. Huh. Well, you never know. Yeah, sorry, I didn't edit it. I didn't edit AI voices over these cutscenes because there's too much dialogue in a specific cutscene earlier, and it went by too fast, so I wouldn't have been able to properly edit it in. Sorry. Sorry about that, earlier. Um, so you just have to have the silent in-game cutscenes. See us off. What do you want about me? I can't let the crew leave like that. The SS Supermarine. It took days and days to complete. You made that all by yourself? Great job, Marine. Yeah, well, I can't leave my any stone unturned. And to that, it's okay. I didn't have what it takes. I didn't think I could do all this eventually on my own, Marie. But I'm not going to give up. I need to keep trying harder. I mean, it took everything I had just to build this thing right here. Marie, it takes a lot of courage to recognize your own shortcomings. It's really impressive that you've come to realize that. Sonic, Tails. Thanks, guys. And I can't just focus on adventures either. I'm going to study hard. Right. The next time we meet, we see each other. Don't be, don't be blown away, okay? And I, I, uh, Marie, come on. The captain's not supposed to cry. If you stick with it, then you we will really see each other again someday. The Sonic. Yeah, it's not like the chaos. The right. I'll make sure that we will see each other again. I'll be sure to find you no matter what, even if I gotta go to your world. We'll be waiting. Bye bye. See you later. Bye. 
Yeah, Mer- I don't know why- I know some people hate Marine. I don't get it. I really don't. Like, she goes through an arc in this game that requires her to be a little annoying, and the only time she's annoying is, like, around the end of the game, before this point, where she learns from her mistakes, you know? And by the end of the game, she learns from her mistakes. But it's like, I want to say it's around, like, the last couple stages before Pirate's Island. The, that's the only time she gets annoying, and it's for a reason. She's going to do a character art, guys. Like, I don't know why people hate her like that, because Marie to me is a great character. And I would love to see her again in a future game. Especially if she, like, develops into, like, a better adventurer and stuff. And can, like, handle herself. Like, that means... That'd be badass. Like, Sega, you really gotta bring Marine back and do that to her. Like, come on. You gotta show what her ambitions did to her. Like, improved her, you know? But anyways, this is the end of the game here. So, I'm gonna end up the video here. Hope you enjoyed. Bye.